Hi, I'm going to show you how to use Nano, which is a text editor on an Upmax HPC cluster. Uh, Rackham, Rackham is the easiest one to get into. Um, and we have described it in the Upmax documentation under the page software. There's an overview of text editors. And um, Nano is a simple text editor. So what I'll be showing you is how to, I'll just log in into Rackham, I start Nano, I show a bit how to use it, and then show that I've created a file. All right, let's log in to Rackham. So let's do that, SSH. We don't need to use a port, uh, X forwarding because it's a terminal program. Um, so, so you don't need to yeah, add this dash capital X to do X forwarding, you just log in without that argument. I don't need to type a password because I have SSH keys enabled, but if you need to type a password, you can do it now. Well, to start Nano, you just type Nano. You don't need to load modules, for example. It's so built in into Linux, Nano is there. So here I started Nano. So this is how it looks like. So at the top, so I can type here, and also the arrows, they work. It's 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 to some extent, it, it's rather natural to, to, to use it, if you've used any regular editor. Um, and here at the bottom you see these um, uh, called little roofs, flying upside down Vs, whatever you want to call them. And uh, this means press CTRL and for example, capital, for example O to do write out. And that is exactly how to save to a file. So I'm pressing CTRL O will save make, make you save the file. So I do it now, Control O, and now it asks me which file name do you want to write. So let's call it um, my nano dot text text file enter and now it's saved. So now I can exit the program using Control Exit. Um, what I'll be doing is I'll change the file and I will forget to save. All right, so I've changed the file here. I'm going to press X, uh, Control X to exit. So I do it now, Control X. And it says this question, do you want to save the modify the buffer? And what it means in practice is, do you want to save your file? So I press uh, uh, cap, uh, an epsilon, a Y, and ask me again to save to, for the file name and it filled in the current file name. So I just press enter to save it. And now I exit nano. So if I can, I, I can of course display the file now, it's there. Um, and we're using cat, it's a tool to display the content of a file. So that's what I did. So here I've shown you how to use Nano on the Rackcam Upmax computer, because it's a very basic tool. There's plenty of information on it, um, but it may help you get started. All right, I wish you a very good day. Bye.